piranhas in movies have been given a very bad reputation as vicious man-eating killers, but they're really not. They're very docile. My name is Gwen Cruz and I am a wild animal keeper here at Prospect Park Zoo and I work with the piranhas here. We have two different kinds of piranhas. Um, we have three orange belly piranhas and 15 red belly piranha. Orange bellies have a lighter orange colored belly and the red bellies are a little bit darker and their bellies look red. We usually feed them uh, capelin, shrimp, or a little fish we call silver size, and they're all frozen that we get in. We don't feed them anything live. We do have other live fish in the tank with them and they don't normally bother them. Their teeth are very small and sharp. They don't look like much, but they can do a lot of damage. When you, if you ever see them feeding, they can tear up those fish really easily. Piranhas are not deadly killers. Yeah. Piranhas are very shy. When we go up to feed them, they usually go down to the bottom of the tank. In movies, they portray them that way because they hear that they're flesh eaters. They immediately assume that they will eat anything that comes nearby, but they're mostly just scavengers. When they go after animals, it's usually sick or injured animals. The piranhas live with a pearl stingray. He's also a scavenger, so whatever the piranhas drop from the fish that we feed them, he'll pick up and eat, and he also keeps the tank very clean. The movies sort of exaggerate their reputation and make them something that they're not. And if you come here and look at them at Prospect Park Zoo in person, you can see they do eat meat, but they're, they don't come and attack you. But they're, they're pretty cool if you just sit around and watch them. They're very interesting to watch them interact with each other and the other animals on exhibit.